Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jackie, welcome. If you wanna see more from me, please subscribe so you get notified when I post a new video. Today's video is going to be a haul. This is my first like in person, like I went to the mall and I shopped haul like ever on my channel. I've been doing so much online shopping the last like year because of COVID and I honestly haven't really shopped like normal. So I have a collection from a bunch of different places. I have Express, Windsor, Urban Outfitters, and Zara, and also an item that I got from a boutique. So I went on a little mini trip for my boyfriend's birthday, so that's pretty much where I got all this stuff and why I went shopping in the first place. So I'm just gonna show you guys everything that I got, and I'm also gonna try and link everything that I got down below, so in case you guys really like an item and you wanna buy it for yourself, I'll have it down below so you can go ahead and buy it and check it out. So with that being said, let's just get right into okay, it. Okay, so first thing I'm gonna show you guys is what I got from Express. Um, I did wear these once um, when me and my boyfriend went out for his birthday. So I got these leather pants. Whoa. So I struggle finding like nice like going out pants. I feel like I always just like resort to like jeans, like black jeans and stuff. And I kind of just wanted to branch out and do something different. I'm absolutely loving like the faux leather style going on right now. And I also love like the jogger look. So I ended up getting these pants. So on the top of my head, I don't remember exactly how much these were. Again, I'm going to try and link it down below so you guys can go see and check it out. But I believe these are around like $30 to $40. And these are so cute on. These are so comfortable. They're like the most perfect amount of like baggy but like tight at your waist and your ankles. So the only problem that I had with these pants is they're actually so warm inside like they're so hot and I didn't realize that that was a thing. The material on the inside is like that fleecy like almost like a sweatpant material which in my head I didn't really like realize that when I bought them because I didn't try them on at the store. I was like oh these are gonna be so comfortable but they were actually so hot like my legs were sweating all night. So if you're gonna wear these for a night out and say it's like hot where you live you honestly will be swamp ass all night just saying but um I live somewhere that's very cold so these were perfect for a night out just because it kept me warm but also when I was out I was literally sticking to my pants all night so that's the only thing I mean it's a plus and a minus depending on where you live how hot it is how cold it is whatever but just an FYI it does get a little steamy in here ghost okay so other than that these are super cute i'm absolutely obsessed with them they're the perfect like going out pant when you want something a little bit different you can make it edgy but you can also make it cute love these great purchase i'm very happy about those next place that i went to was windsor um honestly windsor is like the only store nearby me that's like still open still booming has cute clothes everything around me is basically closed the nearest windsor store is in like a really nice mall that's about 30 minutes away from me which isn't awful but i mean the closest two malls literally suck near me so um me and my friend were racing over to the mall because we had dinner reservations and we were racing over we maybe had like 15 minutes right so i'm like okay i'll be in and out like i just need something for this like birthday weekend so it was like a friday night or like a thursday night or something like that and the mall was closing at like eight i believe but when we walked into the mall we were walking to windsor the gate was like half closed and she was like i'm sorry we closed in two minutes and i looked at her and i was like i drove 30 minutes to get here i said can i shop for two minutes and she was like yeah go ahead and i'm like okay i'm honestly the best shopper ever i have to say like not to like brag but you best believe I was all over that store snatching shit up. So in two minutes, maybe a little bit over, they did wait for me. Um, I was able to grab a few items. So the first thing that I got, I actually wore this with the leather pants, which is so cute. Um, I got this shirt. So it's just this really like thin, lightweight top, but it has a little like knot twist thing in the center. So adorable this fit super comfortable this was lightweight so it was nice because my pants were super heavy and like warm so this was a good combination because this was light um, so yeah it is very like see-through obviously so you do have to wear like a cream colored bra or something underneath it but yeah this is cute i feel like for the price though it was really expensive but again i only had like 
two minutes to shop so did I look at any prices no another piece that you can either dress up or dress down and it goes with literally everything because it's a nice neutral beige color so love that so the next two things that I got from Windsor adorable I absolutely love them but again I only had two minutes couldn't try anything on so they don't fit but are they cute 100% so I'm either gonna exchange them for a different size or just return them but so this was the initial item that I thought I was going to wear for the weekend but I'm like okay if this is too like risque or whatever I'll wear the other shirt so it's this adorable like sheer mesh top this gave me an absolute heart attack when I tried it on because it's one of those shirts that like I struggled to get it on a little bit and then to get it off like I was stuck in this shirt like I almost had to call my mom to help me get out of it I got this in a medium which is usually my size um something that's like tight and really form-fitted like this I go for a medium instead of a small but in this case there's really no like it's a little bit stretchy but there's no like give to it especially in like the arms and stuff so this is way too tight even if I tried to make it work like there's just no shot so I'm gonna either have to exchange this for a large or maybe this is just like too tight and uncomfortable for me to even you know go for but I think this is so adorable I wish I did more stuff that I could wear this but it's just like this little lace bustier but long sleeve mesh shirt I feel like it's so sexy so flattering but again I literally got stuck in it so this was $34.90 so yeah, this is super cute for like going out and whatnot, but it just doesn't fit me correctly. So that sucks. And then same thing with these pants. I did not get to try these on at the store because again, I was, you know, rushing. Again, like I was saying, I struggle finding really nice like going out pants that aren't, you know, or just like nice pants in general that aren't jeans. Um, so I found these and they're like... I don't know what do you call these I'm not really sure but they're so cute they're like business casual pants but again you can also dress them up if you wanted to um so I thought these were so cute they have the little tie they're adorable I grabbed these in a small which I don't know what I was thinking because I'm just not small anymore I don't know I guess it depends on the pants but this was $29.90 um, I really like these but they did not even fit over my thighs so okay so then when me and my boyfriend were on our little mini trip we went to Buffalo New York which is upstate New York um, there was this really cute little boutique it was called blush they actually gave me this bag blush so it was an adorable boutique in like this cute little like buffalo like village or whatever. I'm not really sure what you call it. I saw this jacket. They had a bunch of different jackets which are so in style right now. You know, the little shirt jackets and whatnot. So they had a bunch of different ones. But I saw this one, of course, on the mannequin. And I was like, I need that. So can you take it off of her for me, please? And she did. So, so this is what the jacket looks like. I have a jacket that's more of like a plaid look, um, but this one is corduroy, which is also back in style. So adorable. I love this color. I think this is one of like my favorite colors on me, like this mauvey, dusty rose pink. So I think it looks really good for like my hair color and my complexion and stuff. So I was so excited to see this. It's definitely an oversized um, feel. If it was a small, I could have definitely gone with a small because this is pretty oversized, but I do like that look, so I don't mind, but I think it's made to be oversized. Um, this is the brand, so if I can find this, I will link it down below, or if I can find it, if Blush has like a website that you guys can get it through, I'll do that as well. Um, but this is the brand Urban Daisy. I love this it's amazing quality super comfortable just nice to throw over like whatever love this can't wait to layer this with like everything so and that was I believe 40 to 50 dollars um but definitely worth it so so later on in the day after we went to that boutique we went to the Galleria mall in Buffalo so it's just this really nice bougie huge cute mall they have an urban outfitters there so this is a cute little reusable bag that they gave me so I think I was in an urban outfitters 
years ago and I was like super young so it was more for like my sister I don't even think I paid attention to what was going on so I've been in Urban Outfitters in forever they had the cutest nicest clothes ever it is more on like the pricier side so a lot of things I just like took pictures of and I was like well I could probably find that on Sheen for like um fourth of the price but at Urban Outfitters I actually didn't buy any clothes there because my boyfriend was like we have to save time to go to Zara like you're gonna love Zara and he was like hyping up Zara which I've also never been in like an actual store so I'm like okay whatever so I didn't even end up buying anything at Urban Outfitters I'm glad I didn't because I spent way too much money at Zara but um I ended up just looking at their jewelry because for the longest time I was always wearing silver jewelry like all the jewelry that I have is silver um I would tell people I'm like oh no I don't really like gold it's just because I didn't think gold like fit my complexion um for a while there I was doing like I mean it's still kind of like silvery I don't know like whitish blonde but for a while I was doing like that silvery gray hair look so I'm like oh gold jewelry just doesn't fit with like the silvery tones and I have a cool toned complexion so I just thought gold was not gonna work on me but surprise girl it does i feel like lately gold jewelry is all the rave so every store every website i go on they just have such cute beautiful jewelry that are gold versus silver so i decided to finally transition over from just silver jewelry to gold jewelry and i'm so happy that i did i feel like a bad bitch with gold jewelry i also watch a lot of britney and brooke mooney on youtube my girls i think we would be best friends but that might just be me but they are like covered in gold jewelry and that's just like like i strive to be covered in gold jewelry like that urban outfitters had the most beautiful jewelry when i went there by the register it was just absolutely flawless and everything that i wanted like that i've been seeing online and i'm like do i do it do i switch over but when it was right in front of my face i was like i have to like i have no choice so all I got from Urban Outfitters were some gold jewelry. I still have some like silver jewelry in just because I can't like completely like transition over yet. But um, I got these little hoops. I feel like everyone's been having these like thick gold hoops lately. So these ones are cute because they're skinny on the sides but then a little bit thicker there. And I think these are like the perfect like diameter for... Um, like everyday wear they're not too big they're not too small so when i wear them you can see them but they're not like obnoxiously huge or thick um and they're also very lightweight so i don't feel like they're dragging on like my earlobes or anything like that so i love them i think they're so pretty they just add to my look so 10 out of 10 and then for necklaces i found this layered necklace at first i thought that these would be like um separated so i could wear like the long skinny one one day and then the thick one for another day but they actually come all together which at first i was like dang it like some days i don't want all this bling you know it's a little much but now when i put it on it's just so easy it looks like i tried so hard but i didn't at all you know so this is like the little layered necklace they all come together there's like a thicker one a thinner one a long thin one like i think it's so cute it looks so good with the hoops it just really ties like any outfit together so i just feel like even if i wear a super like casual chill outfit i put these on and it like totally vamps up my entire outfit um, and my style so I'm so happy with these I think these were also on sale for like $14.99 which is awesome so very reasonable like price jewelry and then lastly from Urban Outfitters I also got this inklet set um I love inklets I've been I started wearing inklets again probably like last year um for like vacations and stuff and then it just turned to me wearing them like every single day um, so that was another thing. I have all silver anklets right now, so I wanted to get some gold ones because, again, I think the gold ones are just way cuter than the silver ones out nowadays. So this was a four pack, which I think was maybe at most like $20 or something like that. Super reasonable. So this is what the little set looks like. This is all the anklets that it came with. So it came with four of them. They're so beautiful. These are nice because they are individual so you can wear them just one at a time you can wear two um or you can wear them all together and stack them i'm excited to do that because i think that'll be so pretty 
So this is one of them. It's just a skinny chain and it has those little like little balls on them. So that's super cute and dainty. And then this is the one that I've been wearing. Like if I'm just going to throw on just one, I've been wearing this one. It's just one of those thicker gold chains. This is also in style lately. I think this is so pretty. So it looks so cute on your ankle. So I've been wearing that one a lot. And then these are the other two. These will be good to stack just because they are so fine. Um, but this one is just a little tiny baby chain. So pretty. And then this one is one of those like beaded ones. So again, all together they look fire. But even individually you can mix and match with them. So I love that. And for like 20 bucks, that's such a good deal for all of these so i ended up just getting the jewelry there um but i definitely want to go back to urban outfitters one day and just dabble in some things and splurge a little bit because they have such cute stuff um but now for zara honestly zara is my new favorite store like i knew i would like it but i didn't know i would like it that much with that being said this is what i got at zara so zara's fitting rooms were closed when i went so i kind of just got items that i knew i could be like safe with does that make sense like i know i couldn't go wrong like they would fit either way um but i definitely want to go back there when i'm able to like try them on or have time to like exchange them if they don't fit because their jeans were so cute and their jean shorts like i can't wait to go back and get a lot of their denim um but I couldn't try any of it on so I just wanted to play it safe. Um, I got one pair of jeans This is what they look like. They're just like those paper bag like waist cinched pants So I knew these ones would fit really nice because they had the nice stretchy waistband and the rest are like a baggy Like mom jean boyfriend style fit. I don't know the difference I knew these would fit really nice just because they're very stretchy and comfortable. So these are so cute I love these. I think they're so cute. You can cuff the bottom and then they can be like an ankle style, but these are so comfortable. They look good with literally like any shirt. Um, I ended up getting this in a size four and they're adorable. I love the little Zara on the back pocket. I think that's so cute. So love these. They fit perfect. 11 out of 10 for sure. Okay. So this next shirt, again, like I said, I got some really like basic items just because I could try them on. This is the first shirt that I got. So this is just what it looks like. It's just one of these like almost like muscle tee basically where the sleeves are really long but they're like cut. Um, so this is so cute. It's kind of like that grayish, whitish, very light blue color. I don't really know how to describe it. But I thought this would be so adorable with either jeans, um, like high-waisted denim shorts in the summer with some cute little glasses and little strappy sandals. Like, ugh. I can't wait for summer. So oh, I thought this would just be very universal. I could wear this with basically everything. I got this in a size small and this was only $12.90. So again, super reasonable pricing for nice basic items. So I'm super excited to wear this. So the next shirt that I got, I got in two different colors. This is what it looks like. It's just another little t-shirt again little staple basic pieces i always say that because that's my whole entire wardrobe that's a baggy but tight fit shirt if that makes sense um i got both of these in a size small so this one is just like this like vintagey worn like red color i'm obsessed with this color like i want everything in this color i think it's so cute it just looks so like old school vintagey so this was 12.90 again just like the other one with my gold jewelry too mm, girl stop and then i got the same exact one i wore this once already but i have the same exact one in like this charcoal -y gray black color so super adorable perfect item to add to the wardrobe the next shirt that i got from zara was this adorable little tank top this gives me like lifeguard vibes but again i thought this would be like a cute like retro vintagey outfit look with some like baggy mom jean shorts or whatever so it's just what it looks like it's just like a rib knit um tank top it kind of like dips inward so i mean if you have really big boobs you might get a good side boob from this I personally don't really have that so I got this one in a medium just because it is tighter and um, this was only $5.90 guys like Zara is so reasonably priced like this is so freaking cute for freaking six bucks like stop so 
love that it's a perfect like crop too it's not soup like too cropped but it hits like right to your belly button so love that next item i got is something a little bit different i absolutely love this so i saw this bodysuit and like screamed because stop cute this is the bodysuit i have so many bodysuits but personally on me just the way that i'm shaped i don't really have like i wish i did i wish i had the whoop but I don't so I'm always looking for items that kind of accentuate my body it makes it look like I have more curves than I do so I have so many bodysuits that are just normal like there's no like extra little like cutouts to them so they kind of just make me look like a box depending on what bottoms I'm wearing so I saw this and was like need this so it's just this adorable bodysuit it also goes in again like that one little tank top does so you definitely need to wear either like a strapless bra or like little pads or no bra at all if you want. And then it has these adorable cutouts right on like the waist. So like your tiniest part of your body, that's where it's cut out. So it gives you like that like snatched waist look. I'm so excited to wear this. I think the nice like cream color is perfect because you can wear it with literally any color like pants or shoes and whatnot. So I think this is so sexy, so cute. I absolutely love it. The material is so thick. It's like double lined, so it's amazing material. So yeah, this is definitely on the tighter side just because it is a bodysuit. So I got in a medium just to be safe. And this was $25.90, which is a little bit more than like the shirts and stuff, but rightfully so. It's beautiful. And last but not least, to complete this haul, the last thing that I got at Zara was this adorable set. It was one of those things that was definitely a want, not a need, you know? But in my head, I'm like, I need it. I do. I need it. This is a two-piece white set. My self-tanner is going to absolutely destroy this, but... I'm just assuming I can maybe like bleach it out or whatever but I think this will look so good with a tan like I'm so excited to wear this in the summer so the top part is just like this kind of like a sports bra look um it's a crop top but very cropped so as you can see the material is like that I think it's called like terry cloth material it's almost like that like soft towel-y material which for some things I absolutely hate that material but the inside is just a nice like normal soft silky material so i thought this would be perfect like say after the beach or you know fresh out of the shower after you get out of the pool in the summer because it's like lightweight but it's like pants set so for a cooler like summer evening like tell me this isn't just a vibe or even just lounging around the house in the summer or the spring because it's so lightweight i think this is just perfect so it also has the little tighter band so your girlies won't fall out so it's nice and comfortable and then these are the pants so same material these are what the pants look like they're just cinched at the waist um they are high-waisted so you can hike them up a little bit and then they have pockets and then they just go down it goes down and it cinches at the end which is super nice and they are like a jogger style so they're very comfortable so i'm obsessed with this set because the white is just so crisp so clean i think they also had it in like a tan and a pink which i would definitely go back and get another color i love this i'm so excited to wear this um the top i got in a small and this was 12.90 and the bottoms were also a size small that i got and these were 25.90 so perfectly reasonably priced not bad i mean you could probably find something on like shein for like cheaper but this material and like the fit of it is just like unmatched so I was willing to you know spend a little more for it but i am absolutely obsessed with that so that is everything that i got i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm so happy to get back into hauls it's been a while since i filmed a haul so with that being said thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed my first ever like in-person mall shopping trip haul um i have so many more like spring summery hauls coming your way soon so stay tuned for that so subscribe so you're notified when those come out to help me get to 300 subscribers so if you want to see more hauls then like this video to let me know but that's the end of the video again thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video bye